There's so many things I want to say about, more things I want to say about Florida State. Leave, wanting to leave the Atlantic Coast Conference for good. But there's so little time. But first of all, good afternoon, happy Saturday. Um, look, I can't say, you know, I'm a, as I said before, I'm a big fan of Florida State football ever since I was a little kid. That's for family reasons, all that, this stuff. And I understand why the Seminoles want to leave. They, I mean, they feel like the ACC had lived up to this end of the bargain as far as being a competitive football conference. I mean, after all, the ACC got got raked over the coals by ESPN over that st stupid, sorry, um, media deal that they signed way back when that's by far outdated, right? I mean, imagine owning the rights to Florida State and Clemson, North Carolina for like a bargain. That's essentially what ESPN has been doing, and that's going to be the case to at least 2036, as, as everything stands at this point. But really, can we really deduce who the real bad guys are in this? I mean, to me, it's like no, the, the movie No Country for Old Men. There are no good guys in this. Just a bunch of bad guys, right? So if I were to look at the parties involved, Florida State, the ACC, and ESPN, I think, you know, like I said, none of those guys are making out as being the good guys, but I would damn sure say that ESPN has been the most shady. I mean, they're the ones that strung on the conference in 2016, I guess it was, over a, a deal, media deal, that they knew, that they knew was a ripoff. They knew they were getting the, the ACC uh, properties as, as for bargain basement prices. They knew that. And they've been treating them as such subsequently over the last few years. I mean, look what they've done for the SEC and compared to the ACC the past five years. Most notably, when Scott Van Pelt himself, a Big Ten guy, but, but Scott Van Pelt broke the announcement that the SEC would be announcing this scheduled, um, I think it was after a Monday Night Football game. Now, come on. I mean, we all know where the where ESPN really wants to to uh, to, uh, to 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 butter his bread with, right? It's the SEC all day and all night. So, and and, and one last thing about that man is that ACC Commissioner Jim Phillips, why are you even bothering to show up to work these days? I mean, seriously, why? Why? Because you hadn't done anything else. I mean, this guy was one of those guys who likes to be comfortable and collegial in his own ivory tower. Instead of doing what Greg Sankey, his counterpart in the SEC, as well as, hell, even break your mark at the bid 12 at least. Get out there and mix a commotion. Get out there with a bullhorn on behalf of your own damn conference. And there's plenty more I have to say about this, but I had to do some Christmas shopping and everything else, so I have to run. But Again, this is a sad day for me as an ACC fan and a Florida State football fan that it has to come to this. It's just really damn sad.